Hello and welcome to a very special episode of Ginger News. I think this is the third limited edition chase pop that we've done. So I know that we did a Tiffany chase pop figure that I got a while ago. And we did the Spy Drew chase limited edition pop figure. Um, they both weren't mine, they were from over half. So this is my first limited edition chase pop figure. It's a 40th anniversary Star Wars figure, obviously limited edition chase pop figure. There were two versions of this, um, and I was quite skeptical because I don't really, it's not I don't believe in buying chases or anything like that. It's just I'll only buy a chase if I believe that it's truly worth the money. So they're the normal version of this, and the normal version is Rey on her speeder. Now, I've got nothing against the new films. The Last Jedi was an awesome film. I really didn't like The Force Awakens. I'm sorry, but I really didn't. I felt like it was a Disney cash grab movie and it was just to sell toys. I didn't really like Ray's character in that film either. And Luke on his speeder obviously is like a cult classic little scene. And I just wanted to have a bit of the lore for myself to keep. So I spent the extra £10 because, like I said, the normal figure was 39 99 and this one is 49 99 um, but you know it's a chase I'm going to keep this I'm not going to get rid of it or anything it's just going to sit with my Alpha 5 and sit with my Michigan Frog um, so yeah but anyways we're just going to very quickly unbox this so this is the Luke Skywalker with speeder bike 229 Star Wars original Funko Pop if you like Funko go to www.funko.com and you can turn yourself into a Funko Pop figure um, let me know what your favourite range of pops are. Do you like the movie pops? Do you like the TV pops? Do you like the pop rides? What what pops do you like? So anyways, from this set, there are six to collect. So, 122 is Zuckus. 123 is Luke Skywalker. Endor, Luke Skywalker. So, obviously, 124 is Yoda, but it's Dagobah Yoda. 125 is Princess Leia, but it's the Hoth version of Princess Leia. 126 is Luke Skywalker, and it's a hooded version of Luke Skywalker. And 127 is the Gar um, Guardian Empire Spy. Um, this is obviously a Disney product as well. If you like Star Wars, go to www.starwars.com to check out all the latest and greatest products. I'm going to stop talking and just very quickly get on with unboxing this pop figure. So, why did I buy a Star Wars Chase pop figure? Uh, I like the fact that they come with their little plaques. I think they're pretty cool. Um, I'm an avid fan of Star Wars. If you've been watching my channel, you know I really do like Star Wars. Um, anyways, once we take this out. So that was actually a little extra that they put in the background to make it seem like you're on the speeder bike and you're going at that speed. So I think that's pretty cool. So once we take this out, if we can get him out, that is. Oh, wow. So he's a... Oh my god, he's a bobblehead as well. So his head, look at that, his head moves and he looks like he's on the bike. Ah, oh, I feel so cool. So that's so cool. That is so cool. I'm really impressed with that. And I've never had a chase. But yeah, this is my first chase pop. Um I wonder if you can can you take him off the stand? Okay, you can't take him off the stand. So he's attached to this pop. I can't take him off this pop. Um, you can see both of his hands can do the speeders work no, so nothing moves on this pop except his head but that looks so cool um, he's got even got a, his own little like grass sort of mound that he's on on the bottom uh, it just says www.funko this was made in Vietnam um, classic rebel gear he's wearing obviously and of course it says Branded Star Wars just there. So yeah. That and with that with that little background, it just makes it all better. It just make it just makes it work. So yeah, that was just my very quick unboxing of my limited edition Chase uh Luke Skywalker pop. And to be honest with you, this one is probably never gonna be taken out of the box after you see it get put back in the box in this video. Because it's eventually going to be worth quite a bit of money um, and like I said I spent 50 quid on it so I don't really I don't really want to 
what's the word? I want to display it, but I want to, I want to appreciate it at the same time. So maybe I might take it out once or twice, but it's not going to come out very few times. Um, and hopefully one day, if my niece or my nephews are like interested in Star Wars or something, I'll end up giving it to one of them. But yeah, there's a very quick unboxing of my Luke Skywalker with speeder bike vinyl bobblehead star wars 229 original funko 40th edition star wars hot figure thanks for watching the episode of gmg news i'll be back really very 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 interested to see what you guys think of my unboxing of a steven universe minis because it's the first time i've done one of these catch you soon